Hi, in this video I'm going to demonstrate um, the Fast UK proxy that I use and um, well, I'll give you a quick demonstration of how fast it is. Okay, so there's loads of VPNs out there and um, lots of people use them for security um, but I'd probably say the vast majority of people use them to bypass region locks. So, for instance, I use my VPN primarily to watch um, British television. So when I'm outside the UK, I can't access BBC iPlayer, um, all the UK TV, ITV Hub. My Sky subscription is inaccessible when I'm outside the country. doesn't matter. I've paid for it and I've got a license fee. I uh, pay the license fee. Yeah, I just can't access it because it blocks every IP address that's outside the UK. So I use, like millions of other people, use a VPN to change my IP address to a UK one. Okay, there's loads of these around. Uh, I'm going to show you the ones I, I use um, because one of the things that people forget, people tend to choose these VPNs primarily on um, price, but unfortunately that's often the worst thing you can do because the cheaper the VPN, the slower it will get and the more overloaded. It's not always the case. There's some very popular VPNs that are pretty good, but generally the cheaper ones are really slow. Okay, so I'm going to show you my the one I use, and I've been using this for about a decade now. It's called Identity Cloaker. Now, I'm in the UK at the moment. Um, I'm going to use a UK server. You can see here, um, Identity Cloaker has loads of servers all over the world. I generally just use UK and US. Occasionally, I use the French ones. Um, this is some good French channels, and um, I also use Canadian as well. Because there's some good Canadian TV channels, if I'm bored. Uh, okay, um, and I'm going to Basically, this sits in your taskbar and I connect. I, the VPN is not enabled normally for me, although I can set it automatically. I'm going to scroll down and find... I blurred these IP addresses out because it's best to keep them secret. <coughs> Excuse me. So I'm going to pick the fastest one I can find here, one of the UK ones. I'm going to tell it not to switch. So it's going to stay and I'm connected through a UK server. Okay. So I'm just going to uh, minimize this and I'm going to show you uh, my speed test that I did previously. Okay, here's um, a speed test I did with my normal speed, a ping 12, download of 41.68 and upload of 11 megabits a second. Uh, that's using my normal connection without the VPN. I've got the VPN enabled now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to retest it. Let me just show you. Let's go back and we're going to retest it. So remember, it's about 40 megabits a second, 11 megabits upland speed. And we'll just see what my connection turns out now. Uh, now I'm using um, the UK server. OK, you see my ping's gone up to 28. So there's a bit of an um, increase there. Uh, the reason that is because I'm going through an extra step. So it's going through to a UK VPN server and then it's going out to the speed test site. The download is pretty much the same, 41.42. Um, Sometimes you'll actually, with Identity Cloak, you'll get it a little bit quicker. Um, because it uses an encryption technology um, to actually, uh, compression technology within the encryption, that it can actually speed up your connection slightly. Um, so that one, basically, there's no difference from my normal download speed. My upload speed, you see, can has its impact slightly. I've lost about three megabits a second there. Um, that'll vary. There's, there's hundreds of UK servers. So what's basically advised people to do if you use Identity Cloaker is to, to try a few out with a speed test and see which one's the best for you. Uh, you'll find some work much better. They're scattered around the UK as well. Um, it's difficult to say which will be the fastest for you, but you'll get some idea from the um, screen. Um, but hopefully I can show you there that Identity Cloaker uh, may not be the cheapest VPN, but it's, it's, it's not by no means the most expensive either. It's kind of in the middle. Um, but it is one of the fastest. It rarely um, affects your speed whatsoever. Now, if you're going to use anything to watch video, speed is 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 imperative um if you don't have any speed if you have an overloaded server 
it'll buffer the um, video stream will stop every few seconds it'll it'll drive you crazy so you need to find a VPN server that's quick this identicloaker is one of the quickest out there uh, and I believe it's worth paying for there's a discount code on my video in the top uh, right hand corner so um, try it out there's a 10 day trial which costs next to nothing so um, you can see how fast it works for you okay so that's my um, UK fast UK proxy okay thanks very much for watching